Hello, welcome, Paul here, and I am here at the uh, NPC village. Now, I was going to do some work here, however, I went off exploring, and then I got lost, and then I probably like doubled my uh, map size, uh, trying to find my way back. However, I did find some pretty cool things, and, I don't know, I'm finding that this area isn't big enough to do a proper Warhammer-esque city, despite it having the NPCs, so I'm kind of putting it on hold while I uh, try and find a huge flat area, because that's what I need, really. I will still work on this, but it may not be Warhammer. We'll see. Uh, now, I f did see something pretty cool. In fact, there is a really, really kick-ass looking mountain range somewhere this direction but I mean there's a ton of cool stuff along the way so I wanted to I want to uh, build along the way here so I want to try and find the first place I found I have to follow this river now what I might do is at some point I need to make a uh, never system so I can travel back and forth between areas because I mean it's getting ridiculous now but uh, for the moment I won't do that today here it is this was the first cool little area I found oh my god I thought that squid were attacking that sheep then that would scare me out of the water if that was the case squid pulling the uh, sheep underwater I say squid are they octopus or squid Octopi or not sure. Do squid shoot or out uh, oil or ink? I should say oil, <laughs> ink. I don't know. But anyway, this is the first place I found, which I thought was pretty cool. Uh, I have a couple of ideas for here. One is to, if I cover this up a bit more, build like a little house into the mountain here. In fact, is this even the right place, or is this like another overhang I found? Not sure. It looks slightly different to the one I was looking at earlier. I don't know. It's kind of nice here. So, what I'm going to do is we'll use this. We'll make a little dock, and I need to. Roughly in, ouch, roughly in the middle here. So let's go ahead and... I'm not quite sure what I'm doing yet, I'm just going to wing it. Stick this up. So... Let's say... Let's do something different and we'll make the door... Cogs are turning in my head, give me time. I have a plan. However, do I have some stairs? No I don't. Okay, well, I've got plenty of wood, which is good. We're gonna want some stairs. Okay. So it's kinda dark here. That'll work. Here we go. Let's get rid of all this gravel and place that. Actually, no, that's fine. Do I want double doors here? Huh, not sure. Not entirely sure. This is going to be a very wooden home. Hey, it's raining. But I'm already sheltered from the elements. Result. Let's go ahead and make a door so I'll be in the... So I'll be safe to work 
free of harm. Okay. Now we just need to hollow this out a little bit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Here I thought that was a pick. I thought this is the worst pick ever. Okay, let's get indoors here. Now, of course, I have no room for absolutely anything. There we go. We'll make two picks. Two picks will throw away the rotten flesh. In fact, we'll get rid of the snowballs because I don't really need them. There we go. More peckish for human flesh later, so I'll keep that. Now, the question is, do I make the outside of this out of wood or do I keep it uh, do I keep it stone to blend in hmm. the materials actually don't have any on me. I could cook up some. Yeah, let's do that. That'll look pretty nice. We'll cook up some uh, smooth stone, make some stone bricks. God damn it, give me room. And. As soon as I can find the coal, there we go. Okie dokie, so. Just gonna have to clear this out a little bit. It all depends as well how far. Oh, what's on the other side of this wall? Okay, that's great. Nothing. Perfect. So we'll just go ahead and do this. And as I said, further along here, there's some really cool looking areas, so I'm kind of waiting do any proper building until I get there. Uh, it's basically just huge mountain ranges, so lots of cool opportunities. Right, while I'm doing this, I'm going to, uh, in fact, I'm just going to go ahead and hollow this out, and then I'll show you what I've done. Okay, I've got this uh, hollowed out a little more. Not too much, but it's getting there. I don't know how big I want to make this. Probably not too big. This is just a tiny small house. So, you know. Let's go ahead and make some stone bricks. Knock these out. Place it in the wrong place. Now, I should have... Uh, where do I put it? There we go. Some glass panes. There we go. All prettied up. Out of it. Uh, I probably want to bring this back one more. Be gone with you. So, question is, what else to do to this place? If I want to make it all fancy looking. Oh, it's so dark in here. Hmm. Okay. Nope. I'll put the torches on the window here. And of course I'm going to need some more torches. So 
So, do I... Yeah, I'll go ahead and do this side too. Let's quickly get rid of all this gravel. Oh my god. Just <laughs> get the hell out of me. Get out of here. You stay outside. It's a trier. But I've got a hole in my roof. So let's go ahead and block it up. But no. Let's go ahead and make this shape the same way as this here. Alright, go ahead and pick if you want to. So, hmm, I'm just trying to work out how to do this. Make your mind up. Let's go ahead and uh, bring that up here because what we can do is move out this. Oh, gravel, the most annoying kind of block. It's easy to clear. Here we go, this will give me a bit more room. I can store stuff over here. But I still get a window and all that good stuff. Uh, let me get out of it. I'll stick you here. And what else is there? Pretty sure I had some wool. Yeah, only one. Let's go ahead and put up a little banner. I kind of like the banners that, uh, what am I doing? I'm starting to like the banners, so. Maybe it belongs outside. Ooh, better yet. Oh, that was cool. Eventually... Oh, I just had it. I wanted the double swords. There we go. Maybe I should put uh, torches on either side. Now... The next thing is, are all the walls inside here stone, or what? What we'll that cook. What sort of floor? Ideally, I'd like to have maybe wood, but... Is that really such a good idea? Could use cobblestone, I suppose. What's that going to look like? That let's try it out by the door here. Let's mix it up then. Let's use wood for here. Whoa! 
Alert, alert. Okay, false alert. He's outside. I'm safe. Okay, so... Let's go ahead and separate this off. I'm just thinking because this can be like a storage area, so. And to keep it even, I'll use double doors. That way I can make all this in here cobblestone, and then everything out there wood. I still need to finish the front yet, so it's going daylight now, I'll get cracking with that, so bear with me. Okay, as you can see here, I've done the storage room, it's all uh, opened up a bit and walled off. I need to get a chest organised in here, which I'll do in a moment. I do need some more banners. This room is done, it's not very big. I need a bed in here, really, and uh, move my crafting stuff around. I can move that. So if the bed goes, say, here, we can put the crafting stuff here and I'll put another next to it. It's a little offset, but I don't think it's too much of a problem. So that is done. Okay, out here we have. Chat squiddy. I've tidied up the front a bit as well. Kind of want to leave that open. Oop, I hear something nasty. So, okay. Now, the real question is, how much room do I want to take up here? Let's make it two so you can walk along here without falling in. Now, <laughs> something nasty up there. What I might do is get, um, I need to find a swamp and get some of the vines and have them have them hanging down. I hear something. Not pleasant. Oh. Okay, I'm just going to leave that as a mystery best left unsolved. So, <laughs> okay, we'll uh, carry on here. This doesn't need to be too out, it just needs to be big enough to get up. I mean, the last thing I want is a easy way for mobs to sneak up here. But what I would like to do is have I wanted to do like a little dock, but I'm just looking here. This looks like a great place, because it kind of ends here, a good place to have a dock. Let's have a quick look around here. I'd like to explore the surrounding areas. Ah, and uh, the mountain range I was talking about starts here, so I can quickly show you that, so you can get an idea of uh, what I'm talking about. Although, it's actually further away than it looks. There you go, you can see a bit of it. And it's just loads and loads of mountains and... Oh hey, I got my shears. Sorry, Mr. Sheep. But there's some there's some sheep. I'm gonna get the wool. Make a few more pictures and beds. I'm 
I'm kind of curious if beds stack. I haven't really paid any attention. There's no reason not to carry uh, wool with you now, since sheep regrow their wool. At least in the next patch, I still haven't patched yet. So I apologise for the lack of new stuff. Ooh. Sneaky. Okay, so enough distractions. The question is, do I leave this all natural all the way around or replace it with word? like an ideal spot. Hmm. In fact, let me go make some fences so I can get that down. First of all, let's go ahead and make a bed. bed, why not? We've got the wool to spare. There's the bed texture with uh, John Smith texture pack, looking pretty nice. Uh, what, it, what was it I was wanting? Fences, that's it. Mine go blank. the idea of using these but if I do it one more time is that going to be too small? and I still Wait, hang on, there we go. Forgetting how you can make stuff here. Now, what I need is two gates. Now, I've got to try and remember how to make gates. It's been a while. So, I need a tiny bit more wood. Was it, uh, all right, sorry, that's getting annoying. Hmm, I forgot how to make, uh, ah, ha, 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 he remembers. Nope, still no clue. Pretty sure I'm getting close, though. Nope, nowhere near. Still ice cold. Okay, I'm going to have to work that out, and once that's done, I'll also wait for it to go uh, daylight again and fix that spot there, so bear with me. Okay, daylight again. Look, I had these beds here. Uh, I worked out how to do it. I lie, I went and looked it up, but I have found it. I knew it was something like that. I was just getting the uh, shape wrong. And sorry, my mouse is going a bit haywire, that's why I'm misclicking all over the place. 
There we go. I believe I need two of those. Now I need to replace this little rascal down here. This little block. Door, door, worry. So I already had a door, so that was a waste. Oh well. Now, let's see if this works. Hmm. Something is not right here. I'm not quite sure why I was thinking this would work, but now that I, uh... Now that I think back to it... Although it should work. I know it works with animals, and I'm pretty sure I've tried this with boats before. But, rather than... be unsure, let's just go ahead and test it. Turned around, okay. It is closed. Kapow. It is open. Sweet. That ah, slow down. Okay, awesome, that works. Let's go ahead and uh in fact, you know what? You know what? Let's go ahead and use stone bricks here. In fact, there's not really any point of having the fences here, apart from the gate, that's all I needed, but it makes it look nice, I suppose. There we go. Just saw a little pot. There it is again. What is that particle effect? Oh. This is just a fence post. Okay, I thought it was some sort of uh, mystery. Apparently not. Okay, that's the little boat area done. I could do with connecting both sides. Watch out, squid. So, hmm, we'll see. I might just leave it as it is for now. Put that there. Uh, it's a nice little home. I need some vines though to hang down and uh, make it look all pretty looking. But yeah, I'm pretty pleased with how this little. Uh, Homes turned out. I need to sort the uh, storage area out a little more. But in all, this looks pretty nice. So that's it for this episode. Um, thank you for watching, and we will continue on to those mountains next time. Goodbye.